I'm uh, going to look at the angle between reflected rays uh, when a pair of parallel rays are um, reflected in a pair of mirrors which are at some angle to each other. Um, so first of all, let me draw my mirrors. And I'll specify the angle between the mirrors to be theta. I'm now going to have my two incoming rays. There's one coming in there to hit A and one coming there to hit C. Um, now we can make these parallel to each other using the parallel constraint. Uh, select the two and uh, constrain them to be parallel. Now if I reflect this one in BC and reflect this one in AB. Um, I can now ask, uh, well, let me just, before I do that, let me just change the color of these. So I can focus in on the, the two that I'm asking for the angle between. Um, and let me create a point uh, at the intersection so I can refer to the angle. Um, and so I'll ask for the angle. A, B, C. And I find that's two times pi minus theta. Now, an effect of that angle being constant is that for any incoming angle, uh, point D is going to lie on the same circle. Um, let me just illustrate that. Let me put in the circle that goes through A, D, and C. And let me specify the angle of the one of the incoming lines, um, like the angle phi. And now we can come here and vary and change phi. And we see that that reflection just goes around uh, that circle.